What's up guys? Today we're in Long Island, Bahamas and I'm gonna do the unthinkable today. I'm gonna go spearfishing for the very first time. The tool I'm going to use is this Hawaiian sling. It actually floated to me once in a weed line in Key West, so I think it's meant to be. We're gonna just pretty much check out, it's gonna be a few rocks from where we're anchored right here, and I'm gonna go about 10 to 15 feet deep, because that's about my limit, because I'm pretty new to this, and I'm gonna see if I can catch something. I don't care what it is, I'm gonna bring something up. So stay tuned, and we'll see what I get. <laughs> So I cleaned up that mutton. These 
over here now. I'm trying to chum up some sharks. I see one swimming there. I think we got a nursey boy around here, so. This looks like a reef shark here though. Hopefully we can get him to come up and have a look. Yeah, that's definitely not a nurse shark. But I thought I saw a nurse shark come up from there. These aren't the ones that get fed off the dock all day. Cut my finger cleaning it. Dang it. Why don't you dip? No, I better not say that your mom will get mad. <laughs> Who's hoping I'll get bit? <laughs> Come on, the fans want to see you kiss the shark. Get in there. He's not coming. You know, he's being awfully patient and it's kind of upsetting me because whenever I shoot the fish and I'm down there risking life and limb, they're not that patient. They don't swim around 20 times. They've ran right up on me at Black Point. So like, why when I want to get a picture of you, bruh? You acting like you're shot. I'm supposed to be cleaning my first spearfished fish and instead we're out here playing with sharks. Alright guys, since I went out and I caught the dinner today, old Maddie boy is going to be cooking dinner. We're roll switching I guess today. How does it feel? Well, it feels pretty good because I don't believe in traditional gender roles. I'm a very progressive, very progressive man. I mean I know that about me. Whatever. Let's see what you're making. Fishes. We're making fish. You're taking the grill route, I see. We're gonna grill, you know, I'm still a man. Man's gotta be a man, even if he got sent to the kitchen by his lady, just cause she killed all the fish. So yeah, I'm gonna grill them up, put them in some pouches. This one's got some veggies. Then I think, well, what do you wanna have with it? Rice or like pasta? Uh, whatever you want. All right guys, so it's day two, I'm going out again. I did catch a lionfish yesterday, but the sharks started coming out. I found a new area though that had thicker, fatter groupers and I'm going down trying to get one today. So I'm gonna try to test out my shark bands. I actually found this snorkeling in Boca Grande Key and I've never tried it out actually by shark. So I'm gonna wear it today. Hopefully it helps me out. It's a little bit stormy today, but I think we'll get some dinner tonight. So you did like the deepest dive of your life and you got this fat boy. I couldn't let it go. I had to get it. That's pretty deep for you. This, whoa! whoa! <laughs> <laughs> you get back in there! <laughs> he tried to jump out. But uh, yeah, that's a solid shot too. Like I knew you were hurting. Yeah. And shark bands work guys because I didn't see no sharks luckily. Yeah, honestly the shark band worked pretty good and he was making a lot of noises all right well let's go back down there did you see that big yellow tail there's a nice yellow tail shoot him too 
No, I didn't see no yellow toe. I'm happy with this. I'm done for the day. I did it, guys. I did it. My journey is now a new hobby and I'm ready to go. You're a savage killer. All right, guys, so I did it. I got, I would call this a decent sized fish for me for my first time spear fishing. Second day, I guess. I got a lionfish the first day and I got this delicious grouper the second day, which grouper is my favorite. Pretty proud of myself. I went pretty deep. I feel like that was probably my deepest I could go. I felt like I might die, but you know what? I pushed it. I said, I can do this. It was a goal of mine and I completed it. So I feel like I might got the itch now. Like I might have to go spear fishing more often. So if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you let me know in the comments, like and subscribe and let me know if you want to see more spear fishing to come. And I'm going to just cut them up now. I'm going to eat them for dinner. Thanks for watching guys.